Hello friends, Tony here. In this video I'm going to talk about uh, PHP in 2024 because right now we are in the end of 2023 and if you want to learn PHP in 2024 I'm going to show you some info. So PHP, an acronym for Hypertext Preprocessor, is a widely used open source general purpose scripting language that is especially suited for web development. So if you want to work with uh, web development, I suggest you to learn PHP also in 2024. PHP is a server-side scripting language, which means that is executed on the web server before the resulting HTML is sent to the user's browser. And server-side in uh, web development is very important. Now it's uh, free and open source, it's easy to learn and use, it's very powerful and so on. We'll open a new tab here and PHP is still a popular and in-demand programming language in 2023 and is expected to remain so in 2024. And here are some reasons why you should consider learning PHP in 2024. We have PHP is still a widely used language and as we can see PHP powers over 80% of all websites in the world. PHP is a versatile language, so can be used for a wide variety of web development projects, from simple websites to complex e-commerce applications. Has a large community and extensive resources, so there is a large and active community of PHP developers, which means that there is a lot of support available for learning and using the language. PHP is relatively easy to learn has a simple syntax that is easy to learn even for beginners and is a powerful language so that can be used to create complex and sophisticated web applications. I have opened here a survey from a Stack Overflow for 2023 and we have programming, scripting and markup languages the most used in 2023 which continues uh, JavaScript as you can see, we have HTML and CSS, a Python, we have TypeScript, which uh, is a trend in these days. Then we have PHP right here. And PHP is above the Go and Rust, which also has, are in trend these days. And I have open here programming scripting and markup languages uh, admired. And you can see Rust is the most admired language. More than 80% of developers that used it want to use it again next year. And as I told you, Rust is in trend these days. We have uh, JavaScript, Python, and here is Rust, which is 84% admired. And we have Go also here, 62. Then we have PHP, which is 41% the 42 percent admired and then here we have the programming languages that power most websites in the world and we start with uh, javascript javascript is a scripting language that is used to add interactivity and dynamic behavior to web pages and as you can see here is used by over 97 percent all the websites have javascript included also the html and css and then we have php here good well, then here we have a ranking of the top 10 most popular web frameworks in 2023 based on their usage and popularity we have node.js which is a server side javascript runtime we have react angular in third place maybe because nowadays uh, is not uh, that popular we have django and here we have laravel which is a php framework that is known for its elegance and simplicity and i have many videos about laravel in the channel then here also from the stack overflow survey we have most used uh, web frameworks we have node.js react jquery still Express Next.js. Now, Next.js, uh, if I scroll up, Next.js moved from 11th place in 2022 to 6th place this year. And also, Next.js is in trend these days. Vue.js here. 
and then we have Django and Laravel okay and the last one here is web frameworks and technologies so the Phoenix is the most admired web framework right now so right here 82 percent and we have also Laravel 52 percent and I just saw that Laravel is uh, more admired than the Django which is 50 percent and Angular also so Laravel is more admired than Django and Angular and that's it all about uh, this video friends I wanted to show you the info if you want to learn PHP in 2024 and as I told you if you want to work with the web development I suggest you to learn PHP in 2024 and also to learn Laravel because no one these days want to create the website from scratch and Laravel make it very easy now I have uh, many videos about Laravel if you want you can watch and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like the video, share with your friends and see you in the next one friends. All the best and thank you very much.